Good morning. It is a beautiful morning here in the UP. The sky is blue. There's a breeze blowing. I think it's in the high 60s, supposed to get to low 80s today. This is perfect summer weather in the UP. I couldn't ask for better. I just love this kind of weather. <laughs> So after three, four years, let me show you what's going on here. We have grapes. We have grapes. Look at this. This is so cool. We've been trying for so long. I know they're more down that way on the fence, but we have grapes. Yes. Can't come to Ex Let me try that again. We're in Escanaba, and of course we have to check out the lighthouse. Of course we have to. <laughs> so fake. I just wanted to be on board with Dutch and figure out why he was stopping here. Just I have my little, own reasons. Just a little family picture. It's cut off the top of the lighthouse right there. Well, you put it the wrong way. You put it the other way. Oh. But you're old. That way. Oh, we're doing selfie here. Of you? It's doing a video right now. Show me your arm. <laughs> no, what the <laughs> We've come for the lighthouse, but evidently there's Marina Fest going on. And it's free to the public. But we're here for the lighthouse. Okay, I am home. I know I said I was done recording, but I thought, hey, she just can't help I cleaned addicted. my kitchen. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if Erica got in there. And I made some low-carb food. I made, these are cottage cheese bagels. Have you seen the trend? Everything is cottage cheese right now. Because it's low-carb and low-calorie. And I thought, I'll make some cottage cheese cookies. Can you see those in there? Yeah, 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 yeah those, those are good. What? Honey and whipped cream. Oh. I have never liked honey. That would not you make it better. Like I don't like honey. No, I don't like honey. You won't like honey. I don't like the taste of honey. How unfair! I can't eat honey because it'll make me sick. And you but can you have like honey, it. and you don't like it. I don't like it. Yeah, I always got chicken nuggets and dipped in honey. Oh, that's right. You yes, did. I love honey. You did. Oh, you reminded me of Valerie the way you did that. I got the retainer. No, the way you said it. Well, that's so what I said earlier to Jack, and I said I sound like Valerie. It's like, <laughs> I've never felt like I sound like Valerie. But Valerie is my sister, and yes, you sound like Valerie. Well, There's nothing cool, wrong with so. that. She is cool, so she that's cool. she's yeah, one of the coolest people I know. Yeah, I know you're watching Valerie. I'm not just saying that because you're watching. Now she's probably not watching because she's too cool for my channel. No, I said something. I said something. Uh, explain something. I said I sound like Valerie. Yeah, yeah. The other day I said I sound like Grandma because I walked into the room and I said something. <laughs> Well, clean. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, then you probably sound like me because no, I know I, I sound like me. Grandma. I, not, not bad. No, just not bad. Yes, just it. well, it's genetics too. The way your voice and all that stuff. Yeah. It's like when your dad woke up from the um, when he had the tube removed from his mouth and he sounded like Dale. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I have more cookies. So this sorry. way, I'm doing food prep for. Did you ask me to cut that? No, oh, it's all staying. Oh. I have my retainer in, so I can't I wasn't talk. listening to you. I was already talking, and no, once I, I start talking, that's okay. They just can't see you unless I flip the camera. She's going, no. Okay, you get to hear her, but she doesn't want to be seen. Okay, I think I'm done now. Maybe I'll show you the cookies once they're out of the oven. Hi. Can I pet you? You're not going to bite me, are you? You're scaring me. You're saying no? Yes? Oh, you're something. Nope. Nope. Okay. You're so soft. I'll let you be. You're going to follow me back to the house now? Okay. Ernie likes to follow me out into the woods or wherever I go. If he hears me talking, where'd he go? Oh, he's behind the tree. There. If he hears me talking, he comes out to investigate. I'll tell you, geese make the best watchdogs. We have friends who have chickens and the um, birds have been plucking them off. Ha, <laughs> plucking them off. And I said, they need a goose because the goose will alert you when an eagle flies over. 
she lets us know right away. 